Okay, so I've just developed this plus X in some D94 I've had hanging around since February. And I've got some old peroxide here that I've just topped up with a bit of new peroxide and added some acetic acid. It's around 3.4. It's about 20 degrees. Now, I've just developed, the per uh, this is like 1970s. French Plus X, in fact it might even be 1960s, late 60s, made for TV. And um, so that's what it looks like after the first developer, as you can see. And now I'm going to add some uh, peroxide to the tank. This is probably slightly high in both temperature and uh, pH but it should be decent enough to show you what it looks like. Are we ready? No fizzing or anything so far, which is good. But it might, that might indicate that the peroxide is a bit fucked and it might actually take quite a long time to bleach. So, what is the, we're in the first minute here and there's no signs of any activity. But look at that, it's already starting to turn. And note there's no fizzing, it's not even going very cloudy, it's just sitting there. Yes, look, so that's a good sign. Okay, so we're actually less than 10 minutes in now, and you can see the there's a slight milkiness to the bleach and that's what it looks like after what, eight minutes. So I'm going to give this 15 in total. So here we are at just before 15 minutes. So we're sort of creamy yellowy whitey sort of colour. Out of the bleach now, I've rinsed it. I've, uh, Filled the tank with water and put the reel back in and now I'm using this video light. Can you see the video light? Yes, you know. And it's I've got it actually around it so it's tungsten, it looks like tungsten light really, so it's a bit yellowy orange rather than ultraviolet or blue sunlight. Um, and I'm just uh, twirling the spiral here to re-expose the film and then what I'll do is I'll take it out and now there you go and um, I'm going to re-expose it from underneath here so it gets it from both angles and um, you can either twistle the reel like that or you can just do this you know and I'll do this for about a couple of minutes either side just to make sure that it's completely um, re-exposed properly and evenly. Um, you can't really overdo this, well, you'd have to be here for a very long time to overdo it. Um, yeah. back in the water to kind of do that. This sort of business here. So yeah, and just keep that, do that two minutes either side. So two minutes on the bottom. You gotta make sure you do the bottom because you know, 
often when you're working with the lid off and the light on this top bit the light from the top is fine you know you'll get lots of light on the top but it's the bottom here that, um, that tends to get neglected okay so I've done my re-exposure that's empty and so I've got this instead of using D95 um, which I haven't got any of uh, which would be the normal um, second developer I'm just using some Orwo A71 uh, it says straight on it because I haven't added any um, thiocyanate or iodide it's not a first developer it's just the straight and there you can see that's the A71 so I'm just going to put that in the tank here yeah. and put the reel in and uh, I'm just going to give that eight to ten minutes just to make sure it's nice and uh, black and there we go slightly over but not bad for 50 year old plus X and slightly past its sell bite D94.